coming. How's it going, everybody? I'm Nikki Delventhal, and this is my dog, Camper Delventhal. We live in a 2006 Toyota Prius, and we're here to take you along on the wild ride. So fasten up your seatbelts and let's have some fun. Woo -hoo. Don't forget, if you like what you see, like, subscribe, comment, share with your friends, and turn on notifications. Camper and I would be so thankful. Previously in Adventures of Nikki and Camper, Hotel Prius was in the shop with some, well, all the warning lights on. So we went to my parents' house to figure it out. Camper and my dad had a boys' week. Cheers! It's freaking guys' week! Come <laughs> on, we're gonna party! <laughs> and my mom and I flew to California to continue the hunt for possible new vehicles to move into, just in case Hotel Prius gets too pricey to fix. So we left off our adventures dropping off the truck and ordering a ride to get to True Vans. Do you see this? We would be getting picked up in a Prius. Amazing. All right, there it is. I'm so excited. I have never slept in or driven a sprinter van before, and I've been wanting to for a long time. It was gonna be fun. So we said our hellos to the famous father-son duo, took a tour of the rig. This is so cool. And the shop, and then hit the road. Today we're taking out True Van's Vision X 2023 model, but instead of your average tour where they're just pointing at things and telling you what they are, we're going to go on an epic adventure and put everything to use. We're stopping at the grocery store, none other than Trader Joe's, obviously. One thing I love about the Sprinter van is that you can fit in a normal parking spot because it is a lot thinner than most other vans and builds. Uh, also, the 144 is short enough to fit in a regular parking spot. And that is huge if you travel full time and you just want to do regular everyday things. This fridge is so large, it fits so much. So we bought a lot of food. But where we're going, it's gonna be really hot. So we need a lot of water. I'm gonna store this in this cabinet because watch this. You don't have to worry about the weight. This is made so well, it can literally hold me up. <laughs> it's so durable. This thing doesn't move. They did a great job. Completely stocked up for a week off grid, we headed deep into the desert. Oh yeah. You excited? Okay. Off again. <laughs> All right, we're here. What do you think? It's pretty beautiful rocks. You know what the craziest part is? We don't even have to get out of the car if we didn't want to. Everything's in here. Mm -hmm. This is truly a home on wheels. I feel like I need to do an outdoor shower just to be rugged. Maybe. I'm in a Prius for way too long. There are two showers. They also have this indoor shower, which is massive. Uh, and if that's not big enough for you, it gets even bigger. They have these magnets at the bottom that just hold all the water in. They've even got a clothesline that you can lock right up. And they even have a ceramic toilet connected to a 24 gallon black water tank. But it is beautiful out. It's about to be sunset and we don't want to miss it, but we also want to take a shower. So sunset outdoor shower time. Woohoo! What do you say? You joining mom? No. Okay. <laughs> uh, solo outdoor shower. Let's put these screens down. While the water is heating for five to 10 minutes, we're going to set up the door screens. These guys have one of my favorite screens I've come across because of the design and functionality, but also for the durability. Like, look at that. I'm gonna use all of my strength. They said I could do this. It is not gonna come out. Plus there's extra strength magnets and a locking system for dogs and children. I'm literally going to punch through this and you will see how strong it is. Hang on. <laughs> it's not going anywhere. You also have the option to have it be blacked out. If you don't want blackout, these also easily fold right up and you can just have a great screen. 
Water's hot, shower time. I'm so excited. I love outdoor showers. This is the easiest outdoor shower. Okay, just turn on the pump. Oh my God, it's really hot water. Wow, we gotta turn on some cold water. That water heater's fast. But we don't wanna waste part of our 26 gallon freshwater tank. So we're gonna turn it off really fast. Oh God, oh God, it feels so good though. I don't wanna turn it off, but we need to save the water. Save the water. Don't waste water. Attention to detail. You ready for sunset? Mom, you gonna come up here? <laughs> While we're up here, there's a solar panel, fan, AC. We got our double bar rack. And these vans are made with passenger vans. So they also have the air conditioning from the passenger vans. This thing can cool down the van in minutes and even a hundred degree weather. All right, it is dinner time. What are we gonna have? What are we gonna have? It's a salad night. What kind of salad do you want? It's a bag salad. <laughs> whoop, whoop. We are gonna turn this into a dinner table. But let's say you have more people and you wanna turn this chair around too. It also has a leg that will support it. So you don't need to worry, it's nice and sturdy. This is my favorite easy dinner. So we added all our ingredients, shook it all up, and dinner was served. Cheers. After that, we freshened up got ready for bed, and set up the van for nighttime. I'm gonna show you guys how to make the bed. It also has a safety mechanism where let's say this isn't all the way out, it'll stop right there. So if you have a child, they might not smack their head as hard. <laughs> it's on struts, so it drops down nice and slow. And then we'll get this side. FYI, you can put the bench up as well for more storage. Incoming! <laughs> Blackout window covers, but we want some ventilation in here. We had some laughs and it was time to go to bed. Good night, everybody. Good night. <laughs> Good morning. You guys sleeping in the van last night was amazing. It gets so dark. It's like a cave and it's so quiet. It's like a soundproof this thing. I don't know. That was amazing. Let's uh, make some coffee. What do you think, mom? Some tea. Uh oh. We forgot a pan. So we're going to get innovative to boil our water. These guys have made it so you can have a level table outside no matter how you're parked. That's so cool, isn't it? This is pretty cool. On this screen, they show you the level of your fresh water, your gray water, and your black water. The guys over at the shop were telling me this, that they are the only people on the market who use pressure sensors. That's like something that NASA uses. So it is accurate to the 0.1%. That's cool. Doing my own special kind of pour over. I made my own tea bag. Would you like some milk? I love this. They have hooks, so when I have to put camper on a leash, I can just hook them on right here. Might not be able to work my lower body, but we still got guns. Whew. I'm hungry. Mom, you want breakfast?
Breakfast is served. <sighs> it's hotter than heck outside in true desert fashion. It is freezing in the morning and sweating in the afternoon. Uh, so I'm going to cool off in here, uh, but I wanted to tell you something because I didn't realize how awesome this was until right now. They have 11 Battleborn batteries and a specific alternator that makes it so you can recharge those batteries from 20% to full in three to four hours. And because of that alternator, you don't have to be driving. You can just be on a low idle. Oh, and they have an RV plug-in for a class A. Essentially, you have unlimited power. After we cooled off, it was time to get the van together to get to the next location. And before we put this up, just to show you, this can also be a workstation. Wow, that was a really fast breakdown. Breeze takes like 10 times longer than that. We have so much more time. Oh, I guess I can relax now. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, share with your friends and turn on notifications. And if you'd like all of our videos early access and during that time completely ad free, join our Patreon for as low as $1 a month. Have a great day. We love you all. I'm singing in the rain. I'm using way too much water right now. I gotta hurry up. We only have 26 gallons. How many showers is that? I've definitely used at least three already. Don't do that. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you very much. I'll be here every week. Actually, I probably won't be back here for another six months. So enjoy it while it lasts, kids.